Okay, uh, hello guys. Uh, good afternoon to all. So, hi. <laughs> so I will be explaining on the issue of LMC Gamuda uh, on the government and to our people as well. Okay, the first issue that LMC Gamuda is facing right now is the government need to uh, retender the contract <coughs> because the cost occurred uh, to continue the M MRT2 project is quite high. <coughs> Okay, so uh, what are the uh, decisions for MMC Gamuda? They currently have agreed to cut the cost. Um, they have agreed to proceed with the cost reduction and the cost rationalization earlier presented by uh, our Minister of Finance. Okay, uh, the balance of the uncompleted underground cost is around is valued at 9.6 billion, and the MMC Gamuda has offered a reduction of 2.3 billion, reduction of more than 24% of its original value. So the Ministry of Finance found that uh, although the reduction of more than 20%, it is still not adequate. Um, we need more of the reduction. So um, the question is, is it okay to continue the project on 2.3 billion? Okay, uh, my colleague will continue on that. On the second uh, question, is it wise for the management of MNC Gamuda to engage with the war of words against the government and the social media? Okay, uh, we need to know that MNC Gamuda initially initiated uh, the hashtag on <coughs> save MRT2 and save uh, 20,000 jobs. Eh? MNC Gamuda is the one who uh, started the war actually. So uh, because they want to uh, <coughs> The blur, they want to make the audience blur uh, they, because initially they don't want to cut any cost for their project. Okay, uh, They just want to continue their project on the original price. Uh, but then when the government told them that they need to reduce their cost, uh, they don't want. <coughs> so they started to initiate uh, the start of hashtag same MRT tour. But some of uh, our, <coughs> our lawyers um, previously had a comment on the Twitter, uh, he said that they are not buying it and MMC Gamuda should uh, do the cost reduction uh, to save uh, the 20,000 workers. So our second panel. <coughs> okay, uh, proceed with the second problem that MMC Gamuda face right now is about their stock price which has been reduced by 15 cents. <coughs> However, um, they still want to proceed with the <coughs> contract with uh, MRT2 because they think that uh, before, because previously MRT1 got good, uh, good feedback. Good feedback, which means that they feel that they could guarantee if they continue with MRT2, they will have good feedback as MRT1. So, so that's all for my time. Okay. Uh, so it is wise for uh, for the management of MNC Gamuda uh, to engage in this war of words against the government in social media. And for me, it is this is not wise because. Uh, MNC Gamuda are not acting like a professional uh, work, but it's like the, but they play like political uh, political party, uh, trying to gain sympathy uh, through your voice with the notion of because of the workers. Uh, so I think uh, they should just reduce the cost, uh, even though they get the less profit from it.
which is MMC Garuda in the public war of words. We tend to reserve that for our political opponents. And after all, we wanted to continue the good working relationship to complete the 17.42 billion worth of open ground works. So, the, however, this open letter has been partly ignored by the MMC Garuda because their first intention is not to reduce cost. But by the end, they accepted because they wanted to continue the MRT2 project. <laughs>